and welcome back to Mavro Talks Love, Sex and Relationships. Today we are speaking about abortion. We have got a pre-submitted social media question, but before we get onto that, we'll go around. We have... King George. Stefano. Kira. E. Paris. Sophia. Um, so the pre-submitted question from social media, and I'll leave it for the floor to discuss. Would you tell your one night stand if you were going to get an abortion? I would if, like my one night stand to tell me that. Right. She's okay. Okay. It depends. Mm-hmm. Like, is it a one night stand? Like, I've hooked up with my mate accidentally, or, <laughs> yeah. or, yeah. Yeah. or, yeah. or yeah. is it a random guy? Yeah. I don't even got his name. I mean, I would yeah. do that. Let's let's <laughs> let's say, for example, you matched on Tinder. You went for a first day in a bar. You happened to have sex on that first day, and you got pregnant would oh, you then that's message that tinder match that's back to i personally yeah. wouldn't that's a bit of like, a sticky one it depends on the date i went, don't really know. it's my body my choice so regardless what i doubt that a, a, a one night stand's gonna be like oh no please don't um probably get a thumbs up emoji back like <laughs> i feel like there's part of me that would want to tell somebody because i feel like i think you should only tell um, someone if you're like indecisive about keeping about keeping the baby or not yeah. or if you need support like i think that's the thing as well if you need support if you feel like that person in some way could support you and uh stefano you said that you would appreciate if someone told you why why would you want someone to tell you if it was a one night well friend? now that the the all the scenarios have come out i kind of changed my mind because i guess if it was yeah i met you that night we went home we did the thing then i'd rather <laughs> you just not tell me because i will never know Mm-hmm. And it depends. If you feel like you're gonna have a trauma about it, then I feel like you should at least contact me so I can support you through that. If you if, don't if have if you're that emotional sh- you're, yeah. bond, you're better off getting that support just get from it your done, family yeah. and friends. Because you? You, you never know. Because a guy, you might, even if it's a one night stand, he might turn around and say, "No, I've, you don't know his life, so he might have been wanting a kid for the longest." So, Harris, two. I'm Alex. Samuel. Elise. Bradley. So today's question is: Would you tell your one night stand if you were gonna get an abortion? Or, as the man, would you like your one-night stand to inform you that they are going through with that process? Yes. I don't know. I think Still I think they deserve to know. They were part of the process. So they deserve to know how mm-hmm. the process goes. T? I would tell them, but I wouldn't expect them to care. Like, I wouldn't expect so what, them what to... What if they really did care? Them? Them? Yeah, that's what I would tell them, just in case. Sam? Would you want to know? Yeah. I'm I'm trying to get my head around getting a one night stand pregnant. I'm getting my head around that. <laughs> oh, you're with Ryan. I'm thinking. just getting my head around that. I don't really. Okay, so let me, let me let me but, switch but the narrative me, slightly. Not like one focus. night stand, like you're never gonna see him. Like you on the first date. Then then of course I won't know. Of course I won't know. You would or you wouldn't. Yeah, I yeah. wouldn't know. Hundred yeah, percent. Yeah, but what if it was that one night? So you went to a club, you picked the girl up, you went home. That was if it. If you and still it got my number, let man know. Yeah, I would want to know. Yeah, yeah. It'll be nice. It was even even if <laughs> I if mean, if it's a random person, you know, they, they're free to do what they do, but it will be nice. Even if they've made the decision, I still feel like that's ours, mm. bruv. Do you get what I mean? Like, yeah. it's not, I don't want to know to try and convince well, you differently. If, but that. if they don't but know, but that. if they don't really know you, I'm playing devil's advocate here because yeah. I, I can't. I'm struggling, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if they don't know you and they plan on aborting it. I can get the disconnect because there was already a disconnect. I get it. With someone I, that you I don't two, know. I, I have like it. two different things. Like I don't do one night stands. I've never had one. But if I had, I don't think I'd tell them because I think I'm not going to probably keep it. It's not worth the stress. However, if I've got an emotional connection with you, I think that's bang out of order if I yeah. don't say anything. I just think if we've oh, got to the point wrong. of fucking each other, that's enough of a rapport. Mm-hmm. I've been inside you. Is do you know what I mean? That's enough of a rapport. To, to, bro, drop man a text, bro. Cool, man. Like, do you get what I'm saying? Like, that's we didn't just hold hands and like, all right, you get what I mean? Have a good day. Like, could, we spent time. I could see why women wouldn't. Uh, no, so I'm do I. To, yeah. so they do don't I. want to deal with the stress of the man's opinion or the mm. man's thoughts or the man yeah. trying to get her to change her mind because it depends I'm, on what. See, a lot I'm, of the time, I'm, I'm men in a place aren't. It right shouldn't now. be a stress. Yeah. I don't. I don't. I don't like the fact that I don't want to have to deal with the stress. Yeah. Or, yeah. Like, I get it. It's your choice. Cool, cool, cool. But it's ah, uh, I. I'm it could be from... stressful though. No, no, no. I, I get it, but it's like we're both in it though. But still. if you don't have a say, yeah, it's but... actually redundant. And this is no, the thing. I don't no, know. no, no. Technically, no, no, no. Technically, yeah. No, technically, no. Technically, if a woman decides she's gonna abort, yeah, it's done. You, you don't have a say. But you, would yeah, but you still have the yet. chance to encourage them not to. Oh. If it's a one night stand, I don't even know you like that to even yeah. try and encourage you because that means we're having like. 
if you've already made the decision, and this is why I'm in, I'm in such a mind state, for because me. personally, I, I'm a person I would want to know, regardless, mm. we've done a thing, I want to know, oh, right, you're pregnant, you're, yeah. okay, cool. But at the same time, it is very much of the, well, what's the point? You're yeah. doing it anyway, don't tell me. Yeah, yeah. but yeah. Outside, not, every, but not every man will have that view. Yeah, yeah. What, what Some I think men will try and change your yeah. mind yeah. because either religious views or whatever, or they mm. want to just have that little bit of... I, I also don't feel like it's the end of the world if he tries to have a conversation with you in a respectful way. Because a lot of the times, in such yeah, heightened what... emotion situations, you sort that. Of, there's things that you just haven't thought about. But, but you're saying from a respect... Yeah, yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Always from a respectful place. That's what I mean, we law have of have averages. Let's look at the law of averages of men. Let's not do that. Let's look at the law of averages. I'm unbiased right no, now. Let's look at the law of averages. We have a of respectful men. Yeah. Unfortunately, well. what I'm talking about is... I know <laughs> this isn't the law of averages. We're defeating the law of averages. That's what would make it stressful because you're a nice guy. However, however, on the one night stand, would you know that that person's going to give you stress? Because I'm assuming you don't know well enough to know that, oh, I don't want to deal with it. Because you might be a bare respectful person. <laughs> Say that again. If they're out here having one night stands like that, again, you get <laughs> well, I'm it saying if you were in that situation. A bad one. <laughs> the <laughs> chances are, if a man has a one night stand and gets a girl pregnant, chances are he doesn't he want, want it. He doesn't want to know. Yeah. Yeah. Chances are but he don't want it. It doesn't mean he want it was that as a guilt trip or it was that as some sort of way to make the girl feel bad for having an abortion. Yeah, it's a techie oh, I would feel I like they'd lost. more be like, why are you telling me? I don't care. Would yeah, you just that's what I would feel like. Well, often, do you know what it comes down to for me? Are you pro-life or pro-choice? Because a guy could be pro-life and he's just like, regardless of whatever happened, mm. we did the yeah. thing. I mm-hmm. want to have yeah. a child. And he I, may not even want to be to, yeah, in like, the like, yeah. child's life and all that, but well, he, he feels morally... Time. Because some people feel morally, you need to keep the child. Like, I, I don't need to be there, but yeah. you have to have it. Because yeah. God said, you got to have it. But God didn't say, I have to be there. Yeah. God, yeah. God, God yeah. said, you have to have it. It's the rules. I didn't make them. That's, That's why it. I feel like you should tell them, though. So Because you never know. They might actually want it. If you're yeah. worried about the stress, yeah, the moment he gives you stress, hang up the phone. Do you know what I mean? But I feel like it's... Just have to... Personally, Women ain't robots, they're emotional. I think it's the men's choice as well. Even though like legally it's not and we get to it hear, is, I think yeah. that it's 50-50 yeah. and I think that's how it should be. It's not 50-50. Yeah, right? it's, it's not. Like it's like not 50 90, 10. <laughs> you hear me out. Yeah. Um, <laughs> on that note, if you guys want to get involved in a conversation, please do drop us a comment um, and also follow us on all social media platforms at Mavro Talks. Love, bro.